Hi everybody, I'm gonna show you the cranial nerves. You know we have 12 pairs cranial nerves. They are coming out of the brain. They are numbered from 1 to 12. Cranial nerve 1, 2, up to 12. 10 out of 12 cranial nerves coming out of this brain stem. In my previous video I showed you the external features of the brain stem. Now I'm going to focus on the cranial nerves. So in my previous video I showed you the anterior view and posterior view of the brain stem. Please watch it before watching this video. Now I'm going to exactly focus on the cranial nerve. So this is the midbrain from anterior view, this part. We have two cere cerebral peduncles. Between two cerebral peduncles, this space is called interpeduncular fossa. Inter means between peduncle, between two cerebral peduncles. So cranial nerve three is coming out of this interpeduncular tubercle, just medial to the cerebral peduncle. What about cranial nerve 4? Cranial nerve 4 is the only nerve that is coming out of the back of the midbrain. Here is the midbrain, posterior view. We have superior colliculi, inferior colliculi. Immediately below the inferior colliculi, we have two cranial nerve 4s that are coming out and wrapping around the cerebral peduncle like this. So just keep in mind, cranial nerve 3 and 4, they are related to the midbrain. And cranial nerve 3 is known as the oculomotor. So 3 is oculomotor. And cranial nerve 4 means trochlear. Both of them supplying the muscles around the eyeball and makes the movement of the eyeball. Cranial nerve 5, 6, 7, 8, they are associated with palms. Cranial nerve 5 is a chunky nerve coming out of the lateral side of the palms and it is called trigeminal trigeminal and cranial nerve 6 7 8 they are coming out of this junction this junction is between the pons and medulla it is called ponto medullary junction from medial to lateral we have Two, three cranial nerves, six, seven, eight. And on the other side, we have six, seven, and eight. So cranial nerve six is abducens or abducent. Abducent. Seven, facial. Eight, this cochlear. So cranial nerve C5 is trigeminal. It is mainly sensory. It's carrying the sensory information of the scalp and the face. But it also has motor fibers and supplies the muscles of mastication for chewing and speaking. Cranial nerve 6 abducens like cranial nerve 3 and 4. 3, 4, 6, they are supplying the muscles around the eyeball. And cranial nerve 7, facial, as its name tells us, facial means face, it supplies the facial expression muscles. And cranial nerve 8, vestibular cochlear, it's pure sensory and it supplies the, um, the, the inner ear, it's carrying the information from the inner ear. And it's related to the hearing and balance. And medulla oblongata, here is the medulla oblongata. Rest of the cranial nerves, 9 to 12, they are associated with medulla. Immediately below 8, 
you can see cranial nerve 9 below 9 we have 10 below 10 here we have some fibers converging and making 11 9 is 10 is vagus 11 is accessory and 9 is glossopharyngeal gloss means tongue it supplies the root of the tongue pharyngeal means pharynx vagus supplies lots of area larynx pharynx heart lung and gut accessory mainly supplies the this muscle sternocleidomastoid this muscle and trapezius and where is cranial nerve 12 cranial nerve 12 coming out of here between the pyramid and olive and it is known as the hypoglossal hypo means beneath underneath gloss means tongue it passes through the underneath of the tongue and supplies the tongue muscles its motor so here we have 9 10 and 11 like this so now I'm going to show you these cranial nerves on these models which are hopefully it would help you to know the exact place of this so this is the ventral surface of the brain stem or anterior surface here is the midbrain you can see cerebral peduncles you can see pons down here we have medulla this is the medulla so midbrain we have through two nerves cranial nerve three and four three coming out of this fossa between two cerebral peduncles you can see interpeduncular fossa so this is cranial nerve three coming out of this fossa just medial to the cerebral peduncles but if you look at closely you can see the posterior view of the brain stem you see only nerve which is coming out of the posterior view or back of the brain stem specifically midbrain is cranial nerve 4 and then it wraps around the cerebral peduncle like this so on the lateral side of this cerebral peduncle you can find cranial nerve 4 or trochlear on the medial side we have oculomotor and here is the pons five six seven eight are related to the pons so on either side of the pons two chunky nerves are cranial nerve five trigeminal between the pons and medulla if you look at closely there is a junction here it is called ponto medullary junction you can see three nerves coming out of this from medial to lateral we have cranial nerve six seven eight abducens facial vestibular cochlear and here is the medulla 9 10 11 12 just below the 8 you can see 9 glossopharyngeal below 9 we have 10 and 11 vagus accessory and if you look at closely between the pyramid and olive this is the hypoglossal cranial nerve 12 thank you so much